Okay, I just wanted to give you a quick example of playing the same note throughout the fretboard. Uh, first of all, there's caged, uh, which teaches you the root notes of C, A, G, uh, E, D, B. And then there's the notion of uh, fourths and thirds, which I learned yesterday. So first I'm going to go through caged. Um, which um, I just, I memorized it, and so it, in a way, I think it might have been better if I learned the fourths and fifths, but caged also helped me with uh, um, chords uh, and barring chords, so uh, that was good. So anyway, so here's C. So, um, there's probably, th that's, uh, those are all C notes, but those aren't necessarily the same tone, and, uh, okay, so the idea with, um, uh, with fourths and thirds is, this is the first string, this is the sixth string. The, fir uh, the first to the second, you move four rows down to get the same note. Like the, it's supposed to be the same pitch, but it has a different timbre because of the thickness of the strings. Okay, I'm just waking up. I'm sorry I'm making this video so soon after waking up. Uh, so it goes uh, four, f four frets down from so, if I were to play an open E, then push down on the first, that would be one, second, two, third, three, uh, I think that's enough, or wait, yeah, the four, so four. And then this, the next one is three. So going from two to three, or it's, to use other terms, the high E to the B is four. The B to the G is three. And that's really the only part you have to know because the rest is four. Um, so, yeah, so open E, then one, two, three, four, and then one, two, three, then one, two, three, four, then one, two, three, four, and then my guitar doesn't go. And so, those are all supposed to be the same pitch, but because the timbre changes, um, and it's only, I think it's only really supposed to be applied when moving from one string to the other. So the idea is like, when you're doing the American National Anthem, you go, sorry. So the idea, you see how I moved throughout the strings. So the idea, <laughs> man, I'm going to edit this. Um, okay, so um, the idea is, so you hear the E, one, two, three, four.
Maybe I'm not playing that right. And maybe my guitar is out of tune, I don't know, but it's supposed to be the same note. The timbre is different, but the idea is, um, so if I were to go like... my instructor would want me to do, <laughs> I think, uh, is, uh, so, it starts here, I, I, I'd have to figure it out, but he'd want me to use the second string instead of just playing the first string, so the idea is, you got your high E, then one, two, three, four, then one, two, three, and those are all E's. So either you can learn it by, like, I learned caged, the C, so these are the C's, and I don't think these are also supposed to be the same tone, or like pitch, or whatever. And I just learned that through memorization. But this thing with the... Uh, I don't know how many times I have to show you the E. So, yeah, those are all supposed to be the same. And I got that, like, I didn't memorize that, I just learned that through the knowledge of third, fourths and thirds. So, that was just my point. Okay. <laughs>